Hello guys, welcome back to SheCode. So let's start with the lab. Build an AI image recognition app using Gemini on Vertex AI. It is very simple to do this lab. So let's start. Click on the start lab button. As soon as you click on the start lab button, you will see this kind of timer over here. Okay. And this kind of panel will appear. Okay, this here we have to perform the code. So, in this manual area in the left panel, come down under the heading working with Vertex AI Python SDK. Okay, now here uh, the instructions have been given. So, what you have to do is in the right in the left panel, click on file. Here you have to click on new file, and untitled file will be created just copy this code from here and paste it over here okay then what you have to do is you have to save this file so again over here click on file click on save okay this kind of dialog box will appear this field called name you have untitled slash one likha. just cancel it out and over here in the line number three you have been given the name of the file so you have to you have to just copy it from here and paste it over here and then click on save okay now your file has been created you can see over here now you have this terminal section drag it up what you have to do is in uh, under the line four over here in the manual you have been given these three line of code just copy it from here and paste it over here in the terminal section click enter and run it now what you have to do is copy this line of code from here under line number five copy it paste it over here in the terminal and click enter It is showing some kind of error so we will go again on this line number four again run the three line of code and again run this code okay here you can see it is going it is giving the image instructions the image shows a flat layer of blue blueberry scones fresh blueberries like so we got the output okay you may also encounter such kind of errors it may uh, it may run in first go or it may not run in first go so what you have to do is just rerun this export code again in the terminal and then after running this copy this path and run it in the terminal you will get your out so here you have your code explanation make sure before ending the lab you uh, read it once so that you get the idea that what exactly we did in the lab now after doing all this just go and check my progress you will get a green tick for sure now coming down here you have this end lab button just click on this end lab button and your lab will be completed Okay. Thank you. Bye-bye.